my name is Joshua Perry and I'm here to present our UNLV Senior Design Project, the Pedestrian Lighting Guidance System. The purpose of our design is to minimize fatalities due to pedestrians being struck by vehicles at nighttime. We do this by using object detection to track a pedestrian or a group of individuals crossing the street and using servos and LED beams to fully illuminate the individual, increasing visibility and hopefully minimizing fatalities. Without further ado, let's get into our design. The first part of our prototype is the object detection system. This system comprises of a microprocessor, which is the Raspberry Pi, an infrared camera, and a Bluetooth communication system to transmit all the information of the pedestrian's position over to the tracking system. The second part of our prototype is the servo LED beam control. From here it detects environmental settings to see if the temperature is too hot to operate, if it's too windy to do correct object detection, and also to see if it's nighttime. Here we have three servos connected to three LED beams to be able to track three groups correctly. The printed circuit board has four major parts, a temperature sensor, an accelerometer, photoresistors, and a Bluetooth module. The temperature sensor is responsible for detecting if the system is overheating. The accelerometer determines if it's too windy outside. The photoresistors check if it's nighttime and finally, the Bluetooth module is used to receive data from the image processing unit. From here, this is what the microprocessor is viewing, the camera scene, and also the servo numbers, the positions, and the LEDs, which are transmitted to the servo control system. And my test pedestrian will be walking in front of the frame to be detected by the servo system. Now the servo has moved to his position and the camera tracks where he is at, transmits his position onto servo one. And then the servo moves to the position he has been tracked at. And if there are two pedestrians in scene, Two LEDs will track the two groups. When a group of people are walking together, they are considered one unit, so they are only tracked as one unit. One servo tracks, but once they split apart, they are considered as two groups. for watching our presentation. Hopefully some improvements to our prototype and maybe we can save some lives. Thank you for watching.